it's Shelly here and welcome to couch time of the travel movie. Hi. <laughs> you seem shocked. I just surprised you. I liked that. Couch <laughs> time. Welcome to couch time with the travel movie. <laughs> How many couches will you see? One. <laughs> <laughs> so, we just go up the street and <laughs> sit on the free couch. <laughs> We are counting down our top TV shows, but we're not going to count down, we're just going to tell you and list them randomly. Because we're not very good at this whole organising before we decide to go on here. It's too much hard time. Hard work. So Pen and paper. Oh my god. So, my top TV show of all time, I really, really, really love Frasier. I always watch Frasier on the plane and it always makes me laugh and I can go in any any time and I can pick up the storyline and it is just the best TV series. It is pretty, I like that. Yeah, that's good. Malcolm in the Middle is my dive into. The one that that's, you can just watch and be just like... Just watch at any point. I like a little bit of Malcolm in the Middle. It's always got that little... Oh, and that other one, my name is Earl, but I prefer the Malcolm in the Middle. Dive in there, just have a little swish around, get your giggles out. Pop into something. You fall asleep during it. You don't feel like you've missed out on anything. It's a it's good, just good watch. Yeah, watch good, for the, good for the movies. Just for just good for the sorry for the flying. Good for the flying. You know, you've watched a movie. You've watched another movie. You kind of can't commit to another movie. You've listened to the music. You need something. Oh, mark in the middle. I've seen them all a hundred times, so I can fall asleep. And it's, it's like Friends. Yeah, but but I'm not a fan. Well, hold the phone. Not a friend's We're going to have to hold Gus that's travelling together thing. Yeah, just... I can watch them, but I don't go to... They're not my go-to TV I series. Love, I love Friends. Yeah, I do like Matt LeBlanc. He's my I, favourite. I just, I just think having friends is important. How are you life. doing? Or rather, no, complete different guy. It's not even a TV show. <laughs> that I learned today. Um, I am in love, love, love with Game of Thrones. It is so good. I look at all the fan theory and I've got really into it and I need to start reading the books. I haven't done that yet. But right now I'm enjoying the TV series. I don't know how I'm going to go when there's gaps in the episode. So whatever, you know, like the when it's seasons even. I don't know how I'm going to go when there's gaps in the seasons. But it's, it's going to be okay. Well, Jonesy, you know how I feel about Game of Thrones, so let's move on from that to... Oh, fuck, this is way harder, because I just binge watch everything and then forget about it. Breaking Bad, have you seen Breaking Bad? No. I haven't either. So you don't watch everything? I watch Orange is the New Black. Was it the second season? Kind of lost me, but then they brought it back for the third. No, the third one. Was... The third one lost me. Brought me back for the fourth. I remembered that I won't say it in case you haven't seen it, but I cried a lot hysterically over character. That an incident. An incident. When no, I remember, because I'd completely it. forgotten that it happened. Was watching it, then remembered that it happened and cried like in the second episode uncontrollably. Oh, <laughs> do you know what I do love and I've always loved ever since I was a child? CSI. CSI, have always loved it. I was allowed to stay up late to watch CSI. Was not allowed to watch Buffy the Vampire Slayer because oh. of the way that they're killed. Mum mm. didn't like that. But watching people get hacked apart and wrecked, absolutely okay. Random fact, every time someone gets killed in Buffy, it costs them thousands in visual effects. And oh. there's a lot of people Mom. that die in Buffy and it goes, poof, all yeah. those sparkles. Yeah. That come off them. Poof. Yeah. Thousands. You think they just use the same shot and just dub it in there real quick? Yeah. It was the nineties. We didn't know what was going on. Exactly. Yeah. Pixelated. I love Entourage. That is a go-to when I'm hungover Ooh. or I just want to watch something and not think and feel happy. I quite like that because I've been to LA and I kind of know some of the places they're talking about as well. And you know, I kind of want that lifestyle of just not working and traveling and working in movies. The Mighty Bush? I haven't seen that. Hasn't seen it. Gonna say it's solid gold. Probably, I'm gonna say Coconut Joe. 
All the crack box favorite episodes. Oh, eels actually, eels, eels up inside ya. Find an entrance where you can eel up inside ya. Oh, you have a reaction video coming soon. <laughs> I saw what's well, the one that you showed me the old oh, oh great okay. yeah I saw that one showed you my downstairs mixer do you love me could you ever love me I uh yeah do you love me oh, oh do you love me can I pretend that you love Greg <laughs> 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 uh, you what you fuzzy peach man <laughs> <laughs> all right anyone else oh short and straight stand alone awesomeness. What? Shaw Street is like a soap opera in New Zealand that's been going for everyone's entire life. Since 1995. There you go. <laughs> it's not that long. In... Well, it is in New Zealand because most of your country falls down every couple of years. <laughs> Whoa. Not funny. Hilarious. I loved not funny. <laughs> yeah. Well. Sometimes I think you don't have a heart. I do. It's there. Yeah, exactly. No one else's heart lives there. No one else lives. So they have to live unless they're those special people that everything offers. What about somebody that wears it on their sleeve? That's an idiom. <laughs> <laughs> so if you get bored of us and you just want to focus on her, <laughs> so to speak, <laughs> is a thing you can delve into. Like a badger and a beaver. <laughs> um, to be honest, Happy oh, Valley. Happy Valley. Is it that one with the animals and they kill each other? No. No, it's a copper, and she's really good in ha- fr- set in Halifax, my hometown. Oh. It's so good with the psycho. Like Broadchurch. I haven't seen that. Oh. I was speaking to someone last night though that was like, "Oh, Happy Valley. Is it like Broadchurch?" And I'm like, "I don't know. I haven't seen it." Broadchurch is solidly good. What Grace Point could have been. What Grace Point is. What's Grace Point? Uh, the American version of Broad Church. Ah, Which is the exact same. So It's super awkward. Except it's got all American actors except for David Tennant. You know the Scottish guy that was Yeah, I love through. David Tennant. Well, he puts on an American accent. Ah, it's it's like, awful. It's like Shameless. If you saw the English Shameless first, you're going to love it. If you see the American first, you're going to love that one. That's like kind of how... I think Broad Church is. Yeah. If you saw Broad, Ch- Broad Church first, Broad Church would be your go to, but if you started watching no, Grace no, Point. No, no, Grace Point got like, uh, completely slated, that's why I didn't make any more. Ah, uh, never mind. Broad Church. What? For those of you that like Grace Point and were sad that it got cancelled, just watch Broad Church. Problem solved, you get three seasons of epicness. Um, American Gods, I'm waiting for the next season to come out. I'm a bit excited about that. And I'm hoping that there is going to be a fourth season, fifth, fifth season of Orange is the New Black because they've left it. I want to see what happens in different jails. Yeah, so if you want to see the teacher ball her eyes out, tune in when the new episode of Orange is the New Black comes out. No, because I know what happens now. I'm okay. No, you don't. <gasps> I don't know what happens. I could cry. Uh, uh, so, Vince, what... The middle. <laughs> Vince, what is your favourite TV shows? Mm. What's the one I like? Hardy Books. Big Fat Gypsy Wedding. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hardy Books. Who likes to see his people? <laughs> the, they're in the Hardy Books, to be honest. Yeah. I don't know what the Hardy Books is. It's oh, it's all good. Father Ted. Oh, Father Ted! Black Books! Thank IT you, Crowd. Faulty Towers. Faulty Towers! It's such a good Black one. Adder. Black was, Adder. Was fourth. It never. Well, they're all good. They're all pretty consistent. But the last season... The first one's crap, actually. It, they just didn't find what they were having. The Young Ones. Oh, The Young Ones. Yeah, that's good I TV series. Me. You should you watch have. The Young Ones. I've seen the one episode. Has died. I've seen only seen the one episode. Skins, first season. Yeah, first and second season. Yeah. Third through six, your pants. Yeah. Flight of the Concords is pretty good. Your country people. That's American. They're just cute. But it's a no, they wrote it. And, and they it, they it made out. it in America. They went to America and made it. Uh, how much of it's from. Uh, really? Yeah, they, well, like, that it's all it. Seven Days is good. Those yeah. are our favourite TV shows. Make sure you. 
like, subscribe, and comment. I'm just gonna. I don't know why I'm doing this. My, t my favourite TV show, I haven't actually really got one, I just like to binge watch any television that's on. I'm not one of those fussy people.